Okay, this is just a quick video to show you that you can have a setup on your uh, TV with a high wife acceptance factor. Um, I've got a Harmony remote here. It's just standard Harmony remote. Um, I've got a setting here that says My Videos. Click on that. It turns on my entire system here. Um, and I'm using, what I'm using is a Mac Mini while that's turning on. I'll show you the Mac Mini down here. A Mac Mini, and I've got a two terabyte hard drive, and that allows me to uh, use Myth TV on my TV here. Uh, so you, know, you can use just use your regular remote. You don't have to have a keyboard and a mouse, which is typically not user friendly. Um, so I'm getting all my channels off the air, uh, off an antenna on my roof. Uh, I don't have cable or anything. So if you go over to watch TV on there, and it'll switch on to the TV. So there you go, high def, uh, turn that down a bit. High def football for free over the air. And you can just change channels using the up and down arrows. There's family guy on. On global right now. It takes a little bit to change channels, but uh, it's not too bad. I guess it's the same as the uh, satellite, about the same. And I've got two tuners, so if I go down into my menu here and uh, pick a different source, and switch source, and I can go to my digital input, which is I was on digital two before. So that'll switch inputs, and of course that'll be on a probably on a different channel, whatever channel it was previously on. There you go. Um, so yeah, so you can exit out of there. Exit that. Myth TV actually provide is a PVR, so you can record all your TV. So I've got two tuners, so I can record two TV shows at once. Um, so if you go under manage recordings and schedule recordings, program guide, just like on a uh, cable or satellite PVR, you can see all your TV shows and movies and you can hit enter and you can schedule that three chord right away if you want. Or you can, you can search by different things, you can, you know, go search words, titles, and then you can, there's a previous search I did, house, or you can type in if you type something in new, pulls up this keyboard and you can go through there and type it in. And if you pick uh, house, it'll show you all the shows uh, with house on in the title. And then you can hit enter on those and you can, you can say record. Uh, there it says this show is, will not be recorded because it's a repeat so it knows if there's repeats or whatever so it won't record them um, unless you override it. And if you go into Media Library and watch recordings, you can actually see recordings you have already on from previous nights. It gives you a nice description, and uh, you can hit info and get some more information about the movie. And uh, what you can also do in here is you can watch videos that you've downloaded. So if you've got TV shows, let's say I got Breaking Bad season four and it'll break down the seasons if you go down to uh, Castle and there's a couple seasons on there so you can watch them straight on there all in the same uh, software so it's really user friendly you just uh, use your remote like normal and uh, you know there's there's nothing uh, nothing special about it I guess you it's, it's easily used by anybody um, instead of having you know pull out the keyboard and mouse and switch inputs and then uh, if I want to you know watch do something else on my system I just uh, use my harmony remote and if I click uh, you know watch if I go down to my harmony remote here and click watch TV what it does is turns my stereo off and switches it so there's analog uh, analog cable or analog over the air and I can just change channels it's a little bit faster on my TV but I don't get the PVR functionality so if, Go back to here, activities, 
wait for it to zoom in there, my videos. Turns on the stereo, switches the input, and uh, as you can see here, if you go on to watch TV on here, wait for that to come up. So what you can do on here is you can pause it. And then, uh, of course, you'd have to pause it for a while before you can fast forward. But you can fast forward a little bit. And then, you, of course, you can rewind. So it is a PVR, and you can actually have picture-in-picture -picture and all those types of things, too. But we don't really use that, so I haven't really set it up. And there you go. Thanks for watching.